Welcome to FUYME TV. I'm Earl Batman Stringer, and in this video, I'm going to give my honest review of the movie Evil Dead. Now, a week ago, I did a review, uh, a trailer review of this movie, and I was debating to decide whether or not I was going to go actually to the theater and pay real money to see this shit, or was I going to wait till that bitch came on Redbox? Well, the previews got to me, the YouTube advertiser got to me. And I actually went to the movie theater to check this shit out. And, uh, but I did go to the matinee though. So that shit was like two, three dollars cheaper. So anyway, here is my take <clears throat> on Evil Dead. Now, as you should know by now, Evil Dead is a remake of the 1981, I believe, uh, original movie Evil Dead. And so everybody that has seen uh, the original has said, yo, the original scary as shit. Oh man, Evil Dead, whoop de woo woo. So I'm like, okay, okay, that's cool. I haven't seen it, so I don't know. But I did see the new one, and this is what I think. First of all, just to give you a quick rundown uh, of what the movie is about. Basically, it's about uh, these young kids, maybe college kids or whatever. Uh, they go to this cabin that they apparently used to go to uh, years ago, and they discover in the basement of this cabin some freaky voodoo shit going on that 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 has went on down there whatever and they see this little book down there and one of these dorky motherfuckers actually take the book from the basement and brings it upstairs why i don't know and so he's into that type of shit i guess so he opens up the book one day when he bored his shit and when he opens it up and starts reading through shit he realizes what well, he doesn't know but he unleashes some evil shit right some evil, fucked up, spirited, crazy, demonic shit he unleashes when he starts reading passages out of this book. And so with that being said, this evil spirit basically goes through, you know, all of them because it's an evil force. So it goes through all of the kids. It's like, I don't know what I mean, I think it's five of them, five or six kids. I'm not sure. I forget. But it's like five or six of them. So the base, the, the... The base of the movie basically is trying to stop this evil spirit, trying to kill the evil spirit, and, you know, that's, it is what it is. So, is it scary? Yeah, I mean, it's alright, you know what I mean? It, it, it's, they have some jumpy scenes and shit, but more, it's more gory and bloody rather than scary you know what i mean a lot of shit that happens in it you just be like ooh, ooh. you know what i mean it's not like oh my god i'm scared you know so it's very bloody but i mean for for this day and age is it is it you know better than a lot of the other bullshit out yeah i mean i can see where you could be scared you know but i'm old school i'm used to all that shit from the 90s and shit all that scary shit like you know old school chucky dolls and and freddy krueger and shit like that so you know, it was very, very bloody and gory and shit. Uh, as far as the story, a lot of people, because I've been hearing mixed reviews. Some people hate this movie. Some people think it's scary as fuck. You know, some people think it's great, whatever. I personally, like, it's okay, you know. Um, could it have been scary in my opinion? Yeah. The storyline is very basic, very simple. Uh, as far as the twist ending, there's no real twists scary freaky ending i mean it's pretty much standard ending you know what you would expect from it um but overall you know i'm gonna give it a three out of five right i'm gonna give it a three out of five you know i mean with that and that's pretty good um you know like i said the shit could have been a, a little scarier but i mean it kind of was what i expected you know ultimately it was is what the, what i expected so um three out of five. Oh, one more thing before i go now I'm keep it real. Them fucking previews where they showing motherfuckers in the movie theaters, movie theater reaction. You know, like I was watching on YouTube and even on TV. I, I'm starting to think those is bullshit. Because, I mean, they show people in the movie theaters like, ah! Ooh! Oh, shit! Ah! Ah! Man, get the fuck out of here. It ain't all that now. You ain't doing all that. You know what I mean? I mean, yeah, you might jump a little bit or you might look and be like, yo, that's, that's, that's fucked up. You ain't doing all that shit they show in the commercial, so I'm starting to question those marketing tactics. But it is a decent movie. Uh, if you've seen it, let me know what you think. If you haven't seen it, should you go to the movie theaters and, and pay that money? 
I don't know. If you got a little money to play with and shit and you don't give a fuck. But it'll make a banging ass rental. I let the chain hang, yeah I'm tattered up, and I love to cuss, I just don't give a fuck, see I'm just doing me, and you should do